Hello everyone and welcome to your second royal reading of today, a Wednesday here at Mad World Tarot. And I have the Wandering Star Tarot on the tarot table for this one. It's still about Harry. Harry has been a very busy man. He's been writing letters, he's been writing more letters, he's been recording videos and uh, he popped up, he even showed himself in the flesh at the Pat Tillman Foundation thingy. And now he's in Time magazine as a titan of climate uh, whatever. And uh, interesting timing, just after Earthshot, of course, Prince William and his beloved Earthshot. And suddenly up pops the has been. He is listed as a titan in Times 100 climate list for 2024. There the has been is as a titan for Travelist. And now Travelist is one of those mystery organizations that the Parkle have. Parkles have quite a few of it. Was set up a few years ago. Nobody really knows what Travelist does. From things that I have listened to with half an ear while I have been doing something else. Uh, the people who have investig investigated Travelist, they all seem fairly sure it's some kind of a grift or a scam. That's what I have been able to gather from what I have heard. That, of course, is their opinion and also my opinion. So interesting that this has now shot up in this year alone. The has been has anointed himself or be been anointed as a legend of aviation. Perhaps that was last year. I've lost track. But anyway, say within the last 12 months, a legend of aviation. Then he got the Pat Tillman Service Award despite much controversy and Pat Tillman's mother begging um, ESPN not to give him the award and now he's a titan in Time magazine. You would think that he would be the happiest man ever, the most popular person on the planet, but he's not. Uh, I'm going to have a look at the story with the Wandering Star Tarot, which I think I have shown you already. Apologies if I haven't. Uh, do you want to know what deck I'm using? Lost my mind a little bit. A um, little five card reading. I want to know how this all happened. Who organized this? I want to know if money changed hands because people are speculating that he might have had to buy his place in Time magazine. They do have a thing with Time magazine, of course, has been. And uh, his wife were on the cover a few years ago, the most influential hundred people or something I silly like that. That was hairdresser Harry. And it was really all about her and he was just there as a prop, as a sort of Nicky Clark or whatever he was. Um, but now he's there in his own right, so we want to know if it was bought and paid for, uh, because we're curious and we would like to know. Time magazine used to be very influential, now it's not something I would allow in my house. But anyway, um, I would like to know why he needs to do this. Is it jealousy of Prince William? Uh, is it trying to rehab his reputation while terrible things go on in the background? Terrible things like the thing I have just read on in the previous reading. And then I want to know if all these awards are filling the void that I speculate is there in his soul. Is that void in his soul being filled? by these trophies that he is collecting. I'm now beginning to understand finally why people go hunting. Never could understand it, uh, but I'm beginning to understand it finally. Don't want to understand it, but you know, part of the story is understanding things I might not have wanted to understand. There's the lovers. Isn't that interesting? That's our underlying energy. And I've forgotten, so I need to say it, that this is just tarot for fun and entertainment. And it is all my opinion and all speculation. And I just read energy here. And there is a disclaimer in the box below. Here we have this show of unity. But interestingly, she wasn't there this time. She got left behind. This is the hairdresser picture. There is Nikki Clark or whoever, and there she is with her 
um, luxurious locks or tresses, as the Daily Mail would call them. And uh, interesting that this love, harmony, unity sort of theme that we've got going with the lovers was nowhere in sight in Time magazine. Curious that. So she's kind of showed up as background noise in this reading. It's supposedly all about the has been and he's the hero and he set up Travelist and we're all supposed to be in amazement and awe at his accomplishments, but she's shown up in the background. Huh. Doesn't that make you go, huh? Makes me do that. Situation that we're dealing with. Oh, three of pentacles. It's our little enterprise and team of talent. Never, never. Success, nah. Teamwork, enterprise, yes. Uh, a, a bit of light grifting even you might see in that card if you're me and you're reading energy. And you're quite in this energy because you read it most days. So, Three of Pentacles for me is a little team that got together in a huddle and said, what can we do? William's got earth shot. He's the sexiest bald man in the world. And um, the royals are roiling quite nicely without the has-beens. They've been, the king and queen have been to Australia. Catherine is back. She's doing her Christmas thing. And uh, what can we do? We've been to Nigeria. They laughed at us, mocked us mercilessly. Same thing with Colombia. What can we do? Aha, we have a friend at Time magazine. Ta-da! Uh, so how did this all happen? How, who organized it? Let's ask that. Was it at the has-been and his people? Who organized it? Knight of Pentacles in reverse. It's Harry. But it's Harry in reverse. Interesting. It's Harry who's fallen off his, head, his horse and landed on his head. Uh, one of my favorite Harry cards. Uh, slow. Captain Slow, who's so slow he stopped in his tracks and lost his way and doesn't know where to go and what to do anymore. Interesting that that's shown up in the how and the who place in this reading. So it's Harry connected, but it's two things. Either because Harry has no idea of what's going on, but could be could be because he fell off the horse and landed on his head and is seeing stars and has no idea and has for the last seven years had no idea of what's going on. Possible. But I think the dominant energy is it is Harry's energy and Harry's team who are trying to put him back on his horse and smack that horse on its rear and get it into a little trot. So. Money. Did money change hands for this honor of being a titan in our fight against climate change or whatever it is? The um, person who can only fly a private jet or mostly flies private jet is now a titan on Time Magazine's 100 climate list. Hmm. Money? Oh, yes. Six of Pentacles, in my opinion, of course, allegedly. It's the uh, you scratch my back, I'll scratch yours card. Six of Pentacles sharing. Um, receive family giving and receiving. Of course, you see the one the hand is out. Um, it's a bit cult like this. And I have things to say about cults in a reading when I get the time. Cult with a U, not Celt with an E. That's my bad fowls from South Africa letting me down here. But uh, Six of Pentacles sharing. Um, a quid pro quo kind of a thing. So I certainly, in my opinion, maintain that quite a handsome sum was given somewhere to someone, not necessarily directly to Time magazine, because it's a charity card. So I think it's going to be one of those, like with Oprah, no, they didn't pay me a million dollars, but actually they paid Harpo. <laughs> cough cough and uh, no they didn't pay Harry and Meghan for the interview that they did with Oprah no but uh, somewhere somewhere there is money most likely that got slid their way or to one of the organizations those mysterious organizations they have so many of it's giving me that vibe that they can hand hand up and say no we didn't pay Time magazine why well, I didn't pay Time magazine but they paid someone somehow with something and it might just be that he is so loathed 
at this point that people will hate read this issue of Time magazine. That's my uh, rather cynical take on the situation, my opinion, of course. Uh, let's see why he needed to do this. To overshadow Prince William, to try and rehab his reputation, Nice of Pentacles in reverse, to overshadow some of the bad stories that are going around about him, the visa, the diddy stuff, Archie Well, and its returns that are less than clear. Why did he need to do this? Ten of Pentacles to show that he is worthy of being a working royal. This is all about getting him back, uh, what he thinks anyway, getting him back as someone of gravitas, status, humanitarian, um, can be invited to the best things. One day will be Secretary General of the United Nations. That's what he's trying to do, and I mean that in a very snarky way. Uh, but he does want to establish himself as an authority figure, as someone with a lasting legacy. That's the Ten of Pentacles. It's all about legacy. And so he wants an equivalent legacy to the royal family. A thousand years of history, mind you. But there has been grifting away in California. is doing his best to rival them by being a titan in Time magazine. Ah, it's exhausting, I tell you what. So, is this going to fill the hole in his soul that I, as a tarot reader, speculate is there? No. <laughs> Five of Pentacles. It couldn't be clearer. It's the card of our, of being outcast and lost, lost, uh, banished and exiled, cut off from all the th the abundance, hardship, struggle, illnesses in their poverty, ruin, wretchedness, scapegoating banishment all of those horrid words are in that five of pentacles it cost him six pentacles uh, we've got a little three card reading which you might enjoy it cost him six pentacles he was hoping for ten pentacles but in fact he's down to five pentacles as his outcome He's not going to be welcomed back into that cozy world of ten pentacles where he longs to be. Neil Sean today was saying that allegedly Harry has a whole room in Mudslide Mansion which is devoted to his previous life as a working royal with all his uniforms and his medals and probably all these silly awards that he's collecting. And he probably plays dress up and marches about much, much and lays wreaths and chants speeches and rehearses and uh, bemoans his lot. Five of Pentacles. Not, not a, a happy outcome for him at all. But I would say, in my personal opinion, a much deserved outcome. This is a curious card that's sitting under here because it's her. She hasn't shown up here at all. Uh, and she's certainly not showing up in his life except in what I speculate are old videos but it was about his choice his choice to follow that road and uh, that she showed him she promised him was going to be the road of abundance and marvelousness and influence and bliss which has led to this horrible outcome of the five of pentacles and that is your reading and thank you very much for watching and I will see you again tomorrow